right, Caps fans, what is up? If you're just waking up from the nap time that was the Caps game, you are not alone. <sighs> Total snooze fest and uh, a little bit of a trap game tonight. I think uh, the boys were thinking ahead to the big game against the Flyers tomorrow, and they just came out and accidentally absolutely clunked against this Atlanta team. Not uh, just a putrid and ugly game. Luckily, the Cavs haven't had too many of those this season. I think this is like the first game, this first time we've been shut out this season. It's the first time we've lost by more than like two goals. Uh, it was just complete and utter disgustingness. But as I said, I think the boys were thinking ahead to, to, to tomorrow for the big rivalry game against the Flyers. Thought they could easily come in. You know, Atlanta. You know, we always beat them. Yeah, not so much. Atlanta's a tough team. They rolled over the Caps tonight. Uh, no surprise. When Atlanta scored the first goal on a Ben Ben Eager scoring the first goal, we said, "All right, no big deal." Caps always let the first goal in, no big deal. Well, seconds later, Atlanta gets their second goal on the board. Nick Antropov backs home, backhands it home after a bad rebound given up by Braden Holpe, making his third NHL start. Uh, shot goes into Holpe's glove. Uh, he can't corral it. Antropov swoops it up. Backhands at home. It's 2 0 Atlanta. Less than 15 seconds later, Evander Kane on an ugly sharp angle shot, which just kind of showed that goal was in was in was just a personif personify the Caps play because it was an ugly goal to show that the Caps played ugly. Even though okay. it was a shot coming on the red line, it's barely. Holby was on the post, but he was looking for a pass to the slot. So he's looking like this while Kane's over here. Kane. Jams home the thing, and that's it. That's all we sh she wrote for Brandon Hope. Brandon Hope, three goals, five shots. Not going to help his save percentage or GAA out too much. He's gone, 10 minutes in, and in comes Michael Neubert. Uh, he does a pretty good job. The Caps come out with a little energy in the second period. They just couldn't catch a break. Matt Bradley missed a shot. Mike Knubel hit the post. Um, the Caps couldn't get the luck rolling their way. The power play was stinking tonight. And speaking of Mike Knubel, he did take a puck to the, to the face from Eric Fair. Bleeding, possible tooth damage, we're not sure. He left the game. Uh, we'll have to find out. I doubt he'll play tomorrow, but we'll see if he can go tomorrow against the Flyers. Not sure if I've counted on it or not. We'll have to see how the Caps address that. So the Caps lost. Mike Knubel, they're down. An extra man, so we're rolling 10 rest of the game. End of the second period, Dustin Bufflin rips the shot past Michael Neuvert. No one can follow Neuvert on that one. It was a rip of a shot. And Atlanta's 4 nothing at second intermission. Uh, third period, the Caps just couldn't get anything going. Uh, they had a few good shots. O Ovi had a few good shots. Semin had, Semin had a brilliant dangling display of effort at, at the end of the second period. At the, end, at the uh, end of the period. Uh, the second period is magnificent. I'm just getting tongue-tied thinking about it because it was wonderful. Curl and drag in the corner and in between the legs. The backhander got that was saved by Pavlik. Uh, so yeah, uh, late in the game in the third period, the Thrashers put the icing on the on the cake. More icing on the cake. They don't think they need it anymore. When their Russian rookie. Bermistrov, I think I said that right. Dazzling dangles around Tyler Sloan, and then he dekes out Neuvrith. Looks like he's going to miss, and he comes back and slams it home. It's going to be on SportsCenter. The link of that goal is in the link below in the video bar. I mean, I'm a Caps fan, but it was a sick goal. Go ahead. Watch it in the link below. It's pretty sick. So, yeah, Caps lose a stinker 5 to nothing. We had a late power play at the end to see if we could even muster a goal. No dice, Caps, can't get anything going. And they leave Atlanta, 5 nothing losers. I'm sure they'll get a tongue thrashing after the game. But like I have mentioned before, I think the Caps were looking forward to tomorrow's game with the Flyers. That being said, I hope the Caps come out with better effort tomorrow against the Flyers. Uh, hopefully I don't have another nap tomorrow. But at least I can play some Black Ops tonight. Alright. So... Go Caps tomorrow against the Flyers. Flyers' second most hated team behind the Penguins, in my opinion. So hopefully we beat them, give a good effort. <sighs> Rock the Red tomorrow night at Verizon Center. I'll be rocking it in the room. Go Caps until tomorrow.